Hey guys, hey guys, your girl here, Tanisha at blackwolf101.net. So I have this book. It's called Money Revealed Workbook. Okay. Um, I purchased this program, which is over a thousand dollars. I purchased this program simply to grow my knowledge about finance, wealth, investing and creating a legacy. The thing about money, wealth, legacy, greatness, you know, building something, you know, business, it's a never ending topic, okay? So it's not a topic, you know, that you can know everything about because even Robert Kiyosaki, for you guys that don't know, he's from the Rich Dad Poor Dad himself, he even said, um, you know, he's 70 years old. He still don't know everything about money. So I took it upon myself to learn how to invest in myself, learn how to read, <laughs> okay, learn how to uh, read the right material, um, you know, learn how to uh, build something that I can hand down to my children. So I got this book. It's a whole series, though. It's a whole DVD set. It's a whole thing, and it's a whole transcript book, okay? Whole transcript book. I decided to create my own business system. I decided to create my own business system, my own business structure for my black family. It's very, very sad, guys, that we live in a world where money is everywhere. Let me repeat that. We live in a world where money is literally everywhere. But being that we were programmed, talking about black folks, okay? We were programmed, right? To only think one way about money. 99.9% .9 of black people are not open-minded to earning money other than the one way, which is the job, okay? So I'm thankful, and I'm always give credit to my cousin who introduced me to a company, right? Uh, and network marketing, maybe about 10 years ago. And what that company did for me is it helped me to realize that life is supposed to be live abundantly and, and have prosperity. We don't supposed to be in poverty. We don't supposed to live paycheck to paycheck. We don't supposed to be strapped for money. We don't supposed to be depressed. We don't supposed to have anxiety, right? We don't supposed to be broke, right? We don't supposed to be sick. We don't supposed to have cancer and all these different diseases. Okay, we're supposed to live a life of fruitfulness, right? And one of the ways that we can live a life, guys, of fruitfulness and happiness is if we have money, okay? If we have money, okay? If we have money, think about it. Think about this for yourself. How many of you, right, right now, when you don't have no money, how do you feel? Because I know for me, when I don't have money, trust me, I feel like, damn. I start getting anxiety, my heart start pounding. Now, this was before. Now, I got some coins, right? Before, it was, oh, my God, I can't pay my bills. Oh, my God, my kid need to eat. I started hyperventilating and shit. I used to have migraines all crazy. How do you feel when you don't have money? Because money is the root. People can say, oh, I'm happy being broke, but they're really not. Money is the root of happiness. Money is the root of abundance. Money is the root of prosperity. Money is the root of having a peace of mind. You know, we use money from the day we're born to the day we die. And we are never taught how to use it, how to grow money. As I was doing some research on different stocks that I wanted to buy, I couldn't find now one black video when I say black, that means a black person talking about stocks and bonds. I couldn't find one black person. I said, well, damn, no black people doing videos and teaching people this stuff? Now, I saw Dr. Boyce Watkins, 
right? But Dr. Boyce Walker, sometimes he's too, you know, in and out. Like, I feel like he's too flaky sometimes, in and out, right? He say one thing and then he contradicts a whole nother thing, right? I couldn't find one black person who was consistently doing videos. I saw a lot of white young men killing it, doing tons of videos, okay? So that opened up my mind, right? Because us as black folks, guys, we don't know. Okay, Jay Morrison said this. Ernestine Morrison, you know, said this. Um, uh, Regina Stokes, she's a, like a millionaire, black millionaire in real estate. She said this. We don't know enough about em enough. Angel Rich said it. You know, she's like a black activist. She said, we don't know enough about enough. So let me ask you, right? If you know that money is the root of your happiness, if money is the root of your peace of mind, if money is the root of your abundance and prosperity, are you willing to be a lifelong learner about money? Are you willing to invest in yourself to learn about money, riches, wealth, legacy, stocks, real estate, bonds, gold, silver, oil, business? See, most people don't believe that money and getting rich is possible because again the school system the european school system showed us one way to make money and that one way benefits the europeans it doesn't benefit black people not one bit okay two million black men are in prison two million black children are in foster care Two million black women are homeless or in shelters on government assistance. Well, about four million. Okay. Now, there's white people too, right, on government assistance and all that. But I'm trying to help my people understand that we are in the best of times. There is money everywhere, guys. And if we don't create our own business... If we don't create our own structure, if we don't create our own system, we're going to fall right into the government system. Trust me, the government is working overtime to figure out how to further the European race. Okay, they're not talking about the black race, right? They're talking about how to further the European race. How many of us is working overtime so that we can plan, right, to further our black race or legacy or wealth for our next generation? See, Jay-Z set the standard. He's the first billionaire black in the music industry, but it took him 25 years, okay? It took him 25 years. See, Jay-Z has the mindset of helping black people. He has the mindset of freeing black people. He has the mindset of building wealth. He has the mindset of leaving a legacy, right? So it's not that we can't do it, right? It's not that black people can't do this too. It's the fact that more black people are not exposed to the information and getting the right information, right? Black people priorities are all twisted. They rather look rich than be rich. They rather drive a BMW, Maserati, rock a Louis bag, a Chanel bag, a Birkin bag. They rather have all these things that are expensive and nice just to make them feel good, but they bank account be on zero or they got they rent due, or they car notes due, but they rather look rich and be poor. Now, it's nothing wrong with nice things, but if nice things is taking the basic necessities from you, like food, clothes, shelter, right? That's basic, food, clothes, shelter, right? If you gotta spend 2,000 on a bag, and you can't feed your kids, you can't pay your water bill, you can't, uh, you know, get yourself back and forth to work for the next week, then it's not a priority. It's not a priority, right? So I made a decision, guys. 
Okay, so if you made it to this video this long, so congratulations to you. Because obviously you are the type of person who's interested, right, in learning more. See, I feed my soul. Right? I feed my soul every day with knowledge. I told you guys I have a whole audio book. A whole list of audio books. Okay, let me show you. A whole list of audio books, guys, that I use and I listen to every day. Then I invest in myself. See, if I can't save myself, I can't save my kids, I can't save my grandparents, and I sure can't save you guys, okay? So I got to be able to save me, and in order for me to save me, I got to invest in myself. I can't tell you to invest in yourself if I am not willing to. I cannot tell my children, my spouse, my grandparents, my parents to invest in themselves if I'm not willing to. See, I'm leading by example. I'm leading by example. I'm not hoping that I get rich. I'm not praying that I get rich. I'm not hoping that I build a legacy. I'm not praying that I build a legacy. I'm just working towards it. See, in my Black Wolf class, $25 a month, okay? And what I do is I go over investing, right? How to sell things, okay? How to make your money grow, how to transform your mind as an investor, right? How to help yourself first before you can help others, right? how to bring in income besides a job. See, I'm giving you the education for $25 a month. I paid thousands upon thousands of dollars for stock courses, okay, mentors, branding mentors, books, CDs, all of this stuff, okay, that I paid a lot of money for, that I'm giving back to the black people. Okay, now I have other courses that's higher ticket, which I get a lot of people in those courses too, right? But the core, guys, of winning is my Black Wealth 101 class, right? And this is hard for me to get the, through the thick skull of black people. They want to get right to the money. I just want to, you know, make money on Amazon. I just want to make money, you know, in, in, in this TLC business. I just want to make money in this, my econ business. But nobody wants to transform their mind to know more and more and feed their soul on money, feed their minds, feed their spirit, feed their being, feed their energy about money. We use money from the day we are born to the day we die. This is a topic that needs to be discussed constantly for the rest of our lives, okay? This is why investing in yourself for self-knowledge and self-education, guys, is so key. You know, I meet a lot of people, especially on social media, because I do social media marketing, and I meet a lot of people, they got iPhone Xs and iPhone this and iPhone that. They got the new lace front wig on. They got the new Jordans. Their kids is dipped out in Jordan and Birkin and Louis and Gucci. But when it's time to start a $20 business or pay $25 a month for something, they can't. Because their priority is on looking rich and not being rich. If you're the type of mother or father or person that love Jordans and love buying all the new Jordans, all the new lace fronts, all the new iPhones, and you don't have any knowledge in here, you're gonna die broke. See, our mind is our biggest asset. I posted on my Facebook and on my Instagram, and I said that the only way for black people to get out of poverty, okay, is to create our own business systems 
to create our own business structure and to invest in self-education. Not the education college gave, not the education school gave. I'm talking about self-education. They don't sell this in the store. You have to be connected to the right people to get information from the right sources. Right? I'm a Robert Kiyosaki student. He has groups, right? I bought a lot of his books. I even bought my daughter his books, okay? I'm a lifelong learner, okay? So I have to invest to learn for a lifetime. Right? One of my clients, I told her, I said, she's like, oh, Tanisha, I don't have $500 because I got this bill and I got that bill and blah, blah, blah. I said, guess what? Just keep having all those bills. Your bills is just what is going to make you die broke. So you can continue to pay those bills and die broke or sacrifice something at some point so that you can get ahead. Right? But again, you got to want to fill your spirit with knowledge. You got to want to fill your energy with knowledge. You got to want to fill your soul with knowledge. You got to want to fill your mind with knowledge. The real knowledge. Not the shit the school gave us. The real knowledge. This is real knowledge. Let me tell you. Robert Kiyosaki, David Gardner, Gary um, Gunderson, Ray Blanco, Andy Tanner, Roger Hamilton, Mike Dillard, Paul Zane Pilzer, um, Ryan Morin, um, John Mackey, Justin Harrison, Ron Phillips, Scott Pickett, um, Patrick Bain, Ali Hussein, Jonathan Johnson, Ryan um, Leviticus, De uh, Douglas Andrew, Jason um, Felding, and John Carter. Ain't none of these men black. This is considered to be the money reveal experts, right, of the, the secrets of the experts, the most, okay, the secrets from the most powerful experts in the world on money. Ain't not one black man or woman listed here. And this is the secrets from the experts on money across the world. And ain't one black person in here. Okay, got Asians. Okay, Robert Kiyosaki, I, yeah, I think he's, you know, Asian, right? But again, why can't a black man name be here? Why Robert Smith name is not here, right? Again, we're not doing enough. We're not positioning ourselves enough. Okay, to be in books, right? So that the right people can read it because everybody's not interested in money, believe it or not. Everybody's not interested in learning about money, believe it or not. Everybody's not interested in filling their soul up with knowledge, believe it or not. So as a black person, I got to get myself out of a situation before I can help anybody else get out of a situation, baby. Okay? But I'm willing to invest in myself. I'm willing to show my children. I'm willing to set a foundation. I'm willing to build a legacy. That's why having your own business system is key. So instead of giving my kids allowance, which is for the birds anyway, I'd rather write them a check for working for me doing the things I need them to do for me in my business or not even doing nothing just because I can write my children a check and write it off at the end of the year and they pay no taxes. <laughs> my daughter had prom things. She needed, she needed money for it. So instead of saying, oh, let's go shopping. Let me just use my personal. No, I'm going to write you a check. That's going to allow me to write this off. And now you pay no taxes on that money because you're under 18. See, that's one of the money revealed secrets. Setting up a business structure. This is how we get out of poverty. Setting up a business entity. This is how we get out of poverty. 
investing to educate ourselves, guys, is how we get out of poverty. So I'm a part of this group called Wealth Factory, right? And you could go look it up. It costs almost a thousand, two thousand to get in. So you know, <laughs> you know, for those of you who don't invest in yourself, don't worry about that. Okay. It said, would you like to take control of your financial future? Would you like to have total confidence in your money and your investing decisions? Would you, be, would, you be, would you like to be able to live a wealthy lifestyle right now without impacting your financial security? What is economic independence? Economic independence is when you have enough cash inflows to support your lifestyle that you want and that doesn't require you to actively work. Some people call this financial freedom and refer to the way, refer and refer to the way to get there is to passive income. Okay? What's important? Money decisions can oftentimes be confusing and stressful because we don't have the knowledge, right? He goes on to talk about the old ways that's not working, you know, why people just focus on retirement. This isn't just about retirement. This is not just about retirement. Most people in their 30s, 40s, and 50s think that they have to make a huge sacrifice now in order to secure their future. So they scrimp and save and sacrifice and delay and never take off as if working harder for someone will fix their problems. You already know it's just add more pressure, which is why even the most successful business owner constantly stress over money. It's easy to fall into this trap if you don't have the financial clarity that is a proven wealth architects provide. It's easy to fall into this trap of being broke and impoverished, okay? Into this trap, if you don't have the financial clarity that a proven wealth architect provides. Because the facts is, if you want to build wealth and build it fast, you need a financial game plan that's tailored to you and your strengths. Hoping, wishing, and praying gets nothing done. Hoping and wishing and praying is not a strategy. Hoping and wishing and praying helps no one. Hoping and wishing and praying is not the move. Okay? Sh understanding investing in yourself for the future and now. Understanding how to live a life that you want and a life that you deserve now. Right? Because a lot of people, the problem is, a lot of people sacrifice their kids, okay? They sacrifice their spouses, they sacrifice their peace of mind, and they sacrifice their health just to work for 40 years for somebody who they don't like to just end up working sick until they die. Don't make sense, guys. That's why you gotta live your life now that's why you got to start to build something now, today, not tomorrow, not when you get paid. You got to have to sacrifice. You're sacrificing your health, your spouse, your kids, and your peace of mind already for the job that you hate. When are you going to sacrifice some time so that you can build a legacy and become the wealth architect that your family needs? When? Ask yourself when. If not now, then when? And if it won't be you, then who? No one. If you don't do it now, you'll never do it. You cannot save. There's people that say, oh, I'm going to save up for your class. You cannot save to, to invest, guys. You have to sacrifice. You're sacrificing your peace of mind. You're sacrificing your health. You're sacrificing your kids. Every day when you go to the job, every day you're sacrificing money every day that you go to the job. But when it's time for you to build your own, people don't see the value in creating their own. So they continue to work for others and help them to create theirs.
See, that's why I made a decision. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on finance. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on money. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on wealth. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on legacy. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on investing. I'm going to be a lifelong learner on self-education. I'll never be broke another day in my life. I'm the head, not the tail. I'm above and not beneath. I'm the lender and not the borrower. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. Any tongue that try to rise up and gets me in judgment shall be condemned. I'm happy. I'm healthy. I'm wealthy. I'm whole. I'm happy. I'm healthy. I'm wealthy. I'm whole. I'm a champion. I'm a champion. I'm a champion. I'm a champion. My dreams and goals are coming into reality. My dreams and goals are coming into reality. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. I'm a winner. See, I talk to myself like a boss. I talk to myself like a winner. I talk to myself like the rich. I talk to myself like the wealthy. I have good self-talk. I talk good things to myself. I'm not worried about money no more. I'm not worried about my bills not being paid. I'm not worried about my kids not eating anymore. Because I decided to become a lifelong learner of money, finance, wealth, and investing so what's your next move right are you going to start to create your own business system are you going to invest in self-education and knowledge are you going to invest the time money energy that's needed for your family or are you going to continue to stress over money, sacrifice your health, sacrifice your time, sacrifice your, your, your spouse, sacrifice your money for the rest of your life? Because that's what's going to happen. So make a decision, guys. Make a decision. Take action. My Black Wolf class is 25 bucks a month. In June, I'm going over the money revealed. Like I said, I paid $1,000 for this course. You guys are paying $25. But again, most people don't believe in really making money besides a job. So they don't believe that my black wealth class is important. They believe that, you know what, I'm just going to work my job and then hopefully I get a raise and that's going to be the answer to my problem. And you're far, <laughs> you're way off track. The tax code is not about paying taxes. The tax code is a series of incentives. Incentives. So if you donate to your church, you will get a tax break. If you grow food, you will get a tax break. You produce water, you get a tax break. You provide oil, you get a tax break. You provide real estate, you get a tax break. So if you're paying taxes, you're not helping the government. So there's no point in you getting any tax breaks. So if you're an employee, guess what? You're being charged. 40% tax every single year on your money that you're working hard for, that you're sacrificing your health, you're sacrificing your peace of mind, you're sacrificing your kids, you're sacrificing your, your, your spouse for 40%, for the government to take 40% of that. So if you're making 500 grand a year, guess what, baby? You're only bringing in about 270 a year. If you're making 100 grand a year, guess what? You're only bringing in about 60,000. A year, that's less than four grand a month. It's no money. You need at least a hundred grand to live comfortably in America. If not, you're in poverty. The poverty line is a hundred grand and under. The European system of education produces two types of people, employees and soldiers. People who will do as they are told. They cannot think. They're afraid of making mistakes. And how, and how do you learn if you don't make mistakes? How does a child learn to walk unless it falls down? But school, you get punished for making mistakes. Money revealed. 
blackwealth101.net. 25 bucks a month. We go over investing, how to make money, how to set up a business structure, how to build something for your last name, how to invest in yourself to become a lifelong learner of finance, investing, wealth, and money. Every month. All right, I've been doing this for the last 12 months. I have helped a lot of people have breakthroughs in their finances and in their mind. And that's my goal. And that's my mission in life, is to help my people get ahead here. So you can get ahead here. So you can help others do the same thing, right? Because all the starts is with the mind. So your money could change. So you could be confident. So you can go help somebody else. Very simple. Blackwealth101.net, guys. Money revealed. Okay? This is what we need in our life. And school did us an injustice by not teaching us what we need to know about money, wealth, legacy, happiness, finance, investing, and love. Blackwealth101.net, guys. See you soon.